The 91-year-old actor is the subject of the upcoming documentary You Can Call Me Bill, featuring highlights from his seven-decade career. However, the Star Trek star revealed his reasoning behind the documentary was far more solemn than it may seem. The Golden Globe winner has enjoyed a lucrative and sensational career over the last 72 years. He originally became a household name through the globally renowned series Star Trek but has also since become a best-selling science fiction author and holds the title of the oldest person to fly in space. Reflecting on his incredible career, William casually admitted he doesn't have much time left, which is why he finally agreed to do a documentary. Speaking to Variety, the actor shared, I've turned down a lot of offers to do documentaries before. But I don't have long to live. Whether I keel over as I'm speaking to you or 10 years from now, my time is limited. William admitted this was arguably the largest driving factor behind the documentary. The Hollywood veteran has three children and four grandchildren and declared that this documentary is more for them than it is for him. He continued, this documentary is a way of reaching out after I die. The sad thing is that the older a person gets the wiser they become and then they die with all that knowledge. While William is gleefully putting his own knowledge into the documentary, he also revealed that he's making some physical, tangible changes to his life in what he seemingly believes is his last years here. The actor noted that while the interview was happening, someone was sorting through his wardrobe, deciding what to donate or sell. The author thoughtfully added, because what am I going to do with all these suits that I've got? Don't miss. Gene Hackman in very rare outing as has seen for first time in years, latest, Alex Beresford warns of public meddling in royal family affairs, latest, Immer Day legs it for Naomi as fans work out Alex's identity, latest, what am I going to do with all these thoughts? What am I going to do with 90 years of observations? The moths of extinction will eat my brain as they will my clothing and it will all disappear. Despite being a household name across the globe and idolized by countless science fiction fans, the actor doesn't believe that a legacy can outlast one's lifespan. In 2015, William's Star Trek co-star and longtime friend Leonard Nimoy suddenly died but controversy was sparked at the funeral when William failed to appear. The actor explained that he had made a prior commitment to help raise money for the Red Cross on the same weekend as the funeral, declaring that good deeds always outlive legacies. William didn't take heed of the backlash he faced when he didn't appear at Leonard's funeral, saying, Who cares? I know what I did was right. So it doesn't matter. I'm of the opinion that you die the way you live.